Hi, in this video, I'll show you one of the many ways you can ensure that a purchase you refer is correctly attributed to you, even if the customer changes their device to place the order. This makes sense, for example, if your customer clicks on your affiliate link on their mobile phone, but then places the order on their computer. In this case, you wouldn't receive your affiliate commission via the normal affiliate attribution. If you implement what I show you in this video, you'll also be recognized as an affiliate in this scenario. In order for you to use this feature though, a promo pixel must be integrated on the target page to which your affiliate link leads. If the page belongs to the product's vendor, as is the case with the sales page, they must integrate this pixel. So make sure they mention this feature in their marketplace entry or ask them personally about it. You can find more information about the promo pixel in the video that's now linked in the top right hand corner. The method I'm going to show you works by mapping a customer's email address to your affiliate ID. To do this, you need to attach your affiliate ID as a get parameter to the link to the page that the promo pixel is on, as well as your customer's email address. The promo pixel then reads this information and stores it in our internal system. Digistore24 will detect when this email address is used to place an order and attribute the purchase to you, no matter what device is used. Please note that you must first obtain your customer's consent to transfer the customer's email address to Digistore24. For example, as a text disclaimer. I'm going to show you now a possible use case, namely recommendations via a newsletter email. Let's say you've created an email promoting a product and you want to send it to your subscriber list. In this email, you place a link to the product sales page, a sales page on which you know the vendor has integrated a promo pixel. Now you need to insert get parameters into this link so that the promo pixel can store and link both your Digistore24 ID and your customer's email address. So let's take a look at this. I'm using MailChimp for this example, but it should also work in any other autoresponder similar to this. I've integrated a button here in my newsletter email, which should lead to the product sales page. So I've already stored this link here. I now have to add my name as a get parameter. First of all, I type a question mark, then AFF as a variable for affiliate, then an equal sign, and finally my Digistore24 ID. Mine is example user, as you can see here. And then comes the exciting part, namely the customer's email address, which now must also be attached. Then add an and sign, email, an equal sign, and then the customer's email address. However, you can't just type in an email address here because the newsletter goes to lots of different readers. This is why there are placeholders in almost all autoresponders, which look like this in MailChimp. If you send this email with this link via your autoresponder, the placeholder is automatically replaced by the recipient's email address. If they then access the link, their email address is linked to your affiliate ID via the promo pixel. Way to go! If you'd like to discover more advanced affiliate attribution options, take a look at the playlist that's now displayed.